Hello everybody, welcome back to another legendary location guide here on Borderlands 3. Today I am back and I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the legendary rocket launcher called the Tunguska. This is a returning legendary, it was a pearlescent weapon in Borderlands 2 and it is now returned in Borderlands 3 as a legendary rocket launcher. So to do this you're going to need to head to Floodmore Basin and go to the top corner of the map where the crew challenge guy is located. This is him right here, the big dinosaur called Chunk Stomp. So you're going to need to kill him to get a chance of having the Tunguska drop. He does drop a variety of different legendaries so you might not get the Tunguska straight away but just keep trying until you eventually get hold of it. So this is mine, dropped freshly right now. It is a legendary Torg rocket launcher and uh, we're going to be taking a closer look at it before I go ahead and do some kills and uh, show you guys exactly what it's all about. You can see right there when you fire at the floor the projectile will hit and on impact it will go up a little bit and explode. The red text says crack the sky, it has plus splash damage radius and also a zoom on it as well, that is all the weapon card will tell you. It is a really nice looking launcher, like a, a metallic chrome kind of uh, colour, nice silver, and uh, yeah, I like the look of that thing. Anyway, like I said, we'll give it some tries out and I'll show you some kills. So we're going to be taking this to Jacob's Estate and uh, killing some of the just general mobs near the beginning of the map. So, like I said, this thing, the way it works is you fire it and wherever it hits, um, the projectile will then bounce up into the air before exploding. Uh, this can make it quite tricky to use really because if you're trying to fire a very long distance, you can't just shoot straight because it'll just go straight past the enemy. So you need to kind of fire at the feet to uh, basically plan where your projectile is going to hit. It is a little bit annoying I found when uh, trying to kill enemies because you think the height of the projectile it goes above enemies heads so you think it's not too effective but trust me the splash does work pretty well so uh, although it looks like it's going above them it will actually hurt them quite a bit. It has quite a large splash area so if there are multiple enemies in the way of the projectile they will all be damaged by this. So uh, yeah, that's basically how to use it. A bit of trivia on this weapon. Um, the name Tunguska refers to the Tunguska event, which was a mysterious explosion in 1908, which flattened 2,000 square kilometers of Siberian tundra. Uh, the red text, which is Crack the Sky, is a reference to the 2009 album um, by the heavy metal band Mastodon as well. So there you go guys, that is everything that you need to know about the Tunguska. It drops from Trunk Stomp and it is a legendary Torg launcher that will fire a projectile and upon impact it will redirect into the air and explode. My final thoughts on this weapon are it's not too bad of a rocket launcher, it's definitely not the most powerful out there and it is quite hard to use uh, and sometimes uh, you don't even get the projectile going up into the air, it will just direct uh, impact with the enemy as well. So uh, it takes a bit of planning, a bit of using. Uh, for a multiple damager though, it is not bad really and it can be used if you haven't got a similarly good launcher just to do a bit of crowd controlling and some damaging but it's definitely no big boss killer so just keep this thing to uh, mobs only I would for sure until you can find a more powerful launcher that works better for you. But uh, yeah, there you go guys, that's the Tunguska, the legendary launcher. Thank you guys for watching, check out the link in the description for the playlist for the rest of the legendary location guides. They'll all go into the same folder, and I'll see you guys in the next one.